I'm delighted to present today the, the first presentation in our presentation series of Wealth with Green, taking lessons from uh, international uh, green companies and uh, figuring out how to adapt those lessons to uh, small, medium New Zealand companies. Uh, today, first of all, Team A, we are looking at drawing lessons from Fastway or Patol and uh, Fastway. You can explain more exactly which one it is right now. Good, man. Right. Good evening, everyone. My name is Charlene, and today me and my team is going to is going to present our project, which is on different ways that Fastway can adopt for attaining uh, attaining sustainability. So, firstly, I would like to introduce my team. Uh, this is Wendy, Joban, Harsh, and Sandy, and myself, Charlene. So, beginning. Fastway is uh, basically a courier company that that was established in the year 1983 and is be, is and is and has its operation throughout throughout New Zealand. Uh, after the establishment of uh, Fastway, within 10 years, it gained a massive success and started its operation in other countries as well. So the reason that we chose Fastway is that it's on its way to achieve sustainability and is working hard and. Uh, is adopting different methods that that other companies are opting for a, a, a achieving sustainability in their operations. So the other reason is that it runs on the same principle as is Tolls, which is our the comparison company. So Toll is basically the international company that we have selected, and current which is currently working on a massive global. Uh, sustainability program so this gave us a good reason for selecting toll as a as a like role company for uh, for dip for the for comparing fastway for different ways that it can uh, adopt from toll uh, the other company is interface so interface is again a world's largest design and manufacturing company and they are on their mission they are on the they have a great vision of uh, achieving mission zero and they have a target of uh, achieving zero pollution by the uh, year 2020 so now i'd like to hand over to wendy which will further continue okay i'll talk about the uh, environmental sustainability program by both of them uh, the first one will be mission zero by 2020. should i repeat it The first one will be the uh, Mission Zero by Interface. Uh, Mission Zero is uh, established in 1994, and uh, during uh, the is okay, uh, Interface's founder Ray Anderson recognized that the way industry work was unsustainable. So, um, the Earth's valu valuable natural resources was being used up and threw it away. The waste from industrial process uh, and emission of greenhouse gas uh, polluted by the polluted environment and also causing global warming. So therefore, the interface is on a mission to become the first fully sustainable company. They call this Mission Zero. And this is a huge challenge for interface and it's like a mount, mountain higher than Mount Everest. That's why they call it um, seven fronts of Mount Sustainability. They actually set the path to scale uh, Mount Sustainability through seven ambitious fronts. Um, I will give uh, a few important examples of the seven ways, which is uh, they move on, moving towards zero waste and increasing the efficiency and using more renewable energy in the industry. And also they are having, uh, implementing the closed loop in recycling to use uh, copying natural's way of turning waste into food. So by 2011, it's already achieved 60% of the whole mission when uh, the founder passed away. And to this year is the 20th anniversary of the Mission Zero. And as what uh, my teammates say, uh, they aim to achieve this mission by 2020. And next will be uh, the Smart Green by uh, Toe Company. Okay. It's an initiative by Toe. Uh, for this environmental sustainable program. Toe is a logistic company that sees environment sustainably as a core corporate responsibility. 
green, smarter green is established in 2010. And then it reflects the impact of operation on environmental, including the impact on climate change especially. And then the target of smarter green are to reduce greenhouse gas in the in 10 cities and developing comprehensive initiative for the diverse operation to improve environmental performance okay. in the company. There are actually six different categories under the smarter green initiative, which will, which will explain by Joban next. So I'm going to describe more about the missions of uh, our old companies. First, like the mission zero by interface, the first target is to eliminate the waste. And since 1996, they eliminate their waste by 91% by using their raw material in a better way to for manufacturing. And the second one is the transport transportation emission reduction like they move their warehouse closers like from where they're producing the raw material and the finished goods they move all those warehouses closer so they use the less transport and produce less emission to save the environment and the third one is producing value and quality they like they prefer to produce the high quality of goods instead of producing the large volumes so in, in which they like they cut down their waste as well and whatever the waste they use it for a recycling and reproducing again and the third one is the elimination of, or fourth, elimination of harmful and poisonous gases. They are still doing a search on a different methods, like which chemical not good for the environment. They totally avoiding those chemicals, not used for the production process. And try, try, try to find out the en environment friendly methods for the production, for their goods. And the last one is awareness. They are they wearing their like, they start a few programs to aware their stakeholders, their staff about the environment, how they're going to protect the environment in the future, and how they can put a, like, a, come as a role model in a global industry to save the environment. And the toll, they started their smart grip program, and they done a lot of his research, because toll is a mostly a transport company, and they have a, they try to save the environment in different ways. Like, they done a search on the drivers first, because they think that the behavior of driver impact on the environment as well, if, like, if the driver is not happy with their jobs, they're going to drive rough and it's gonna, the bike is going to produce more emission on the roads. They're going to use the long tracks. So it's going to cost them more money and they're going to use more diesels and petrol. And they're going to, and the national smarter energy, they're looking in the future, they're looking for uh, to use the smarter energy ways. Like they try to reduce the use of fossil fuels for their transportation. And they're looking at the solar system LPG gases or biodiesel to use for their vehicles and the smarter vehicles. Everyone knows in these days there's a more companies producing hybrid vehicles now, which one like they can use on a batteries as well and plus diesel or petrol. So they're preferring to use those vehicles and plus bicycles in their busy areas in the cities to deliver their couriers. And plus they're using a battery trolleys, which one they can use on the high traffic areas so they try to avoid the use of the vehicles which producing emission or carbon in the environment and the, the fourth one is smarter planning they're planning their routes very smartly like if the courier is going on a one way make sure he deliver all the couriers on the same road not coming back through this way they're saving a lot of fossil fuels and reducing the emission of carbon in the environment and the last one is the smarter facilities they try to like use the space in the vehicles proper way so they can put more cabins inside so they can carry a lot of weight at the same time so in this way they can save a one trip and save some fossil fuels and the car produce less emission on their way now harsh will give you some more about give you some more explanation about these ones okay. yep. thanks for me in and thanks for the mic mm -hmm. a second So yes, the team has explained to you about this, uh, the description of the Mission Zero and the smarter green uh, things and I will take you forward with the advantages to the target company. So what advantages are they going to derive with applying the smarter green projects? So as we are taken cues from the smarter green project of Toll, 
they can go for reducing emission and how they can do it uh, they can do a uh, smarter fit uh, smarter driving behavior and smarter energy so they can use have hybrid vehicles and levs that are low emission vehicles mm -hmm. low friction tires and lightweight materials to uh, to to increase their productivity and better product organization to carry their products that will help to carry more product and reduce emission and increase the productivity more they can do is achieve sustainability how can they do that they can build the warehouse in such a way that uh, have thing regards to environmental conditions and heating and energy management systems that will inc increase the sustainability this all will contain an increase in productivity and profits and competitive advantage for fastway there are some challenges to fastway which it has to look on to for doing this first one is the stakeholder and franchise fastway as we know that fastway has a lot of franchises in new zealand there they have about 41 franchises in new zealand so to they will require more information and knowledge from other companies as well uh, as to how they do it and to apply that in in their company they will able to help to change the processes and operations to improve the go on the way of achieving the sustainability so they have to change this processes in the internal systems and help to also apply some external managers to do this and changes and business processes and procedures will be needed so these are our recommendations for doing it first they can go for conducting a program and communicate these things with employee because employee will, will be the major reason who will be not developing this change in them so they can go for programs like quest which is by which was taken by interface with quest meaning quality utilizing ample employee suggestions and teamwork so they can go for this program and they can hire some managers from outside for continuous improvements they have to define the waste of the company waste such as uh, waste in packaging other materials the scrap materials wrong invoicing uh, as and the uh, doing the courier thing and less productivity and they have to prepare a budget for going the smarter way as tall as than it and guide up impress the stakeholders and they have to monitor that then regularly so these are the recommendations and questions are welcome major contributor to New Zealand's greenhouse, yep. greenhouse gases. So yep. You've chosen an, an important area to, to concentrate yes. on. Carbon emissions. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. So I, I, I'm curious to know, um, do, you, do you know what proportion of transport energy mm -hmm. is, is accounted for by, by, um, by freight? Mm -hmm. um, there's domestic, yeah. you know, there's domestic um, cars and that sort of thing, light light vehicles. Yeah. Uh, how much is, is accounted for by 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 freight, by heavy long distance freight and, and local freight carrying? Like for the long distance, they're using more the big trucks, which one they carry the bulk, like a yeah. lot of freight at a one time. But for the if we talk about Auckland region, they're using a lot of vehicles because of the conjunctions in the Auckland region and there's a more traffic so they are using a small vehicles which producing a more carbon emission like fast way using only about 60 vans in only in the Auckland region to deliver their couriers and if they're sending a freight out of Auckland they're using only one truck per city so mm. that's the difference yeah yeah and especially in the Auckland cities the main part of their freight going to the Auckland CBD which one is a more congested so and they're still using their vans, but on the other hand, told using their like bicycles and the small trolleys, the battery ones. So which one they can just drive on a footpath or a walkway, so I they can save the mm. save from traffic and carbon emissions and everything. Mm -hmm. Mm Like 
faster is a courier company and if they use the less material for the packaging, it's a totally waste. So if they use the light methods, because what told doing now, if they like if they're going to deliver at home, they are not packaging that stuff, but they're handling with the K. So they can save the packaging, save the paper, save the labels. So and also the waste so interface has done a great way with the help of Quest, that is quality utilizing employee suggestions and teamwork. So we have taken that from interface to, to apply for Fastway to communicate that program to the employees and impress them with the thing. Uh, but yeah, we know that we have to communicate. How do you do it? If you are recommending to the company mm -hmm. uh, by looking at a particular uh, different company who has already done that, yes. how would you modify it and implement it over here? Like Toll has said, so we will uh, communicate that way that this company has done it and we can also achieve this way yeah. because oh. it is. Like I just give you an example. Yeah, that's like right. like if you are receiving a courier and we just <coughs> inform you first, like we are going to deliver that courier between this time, so make sure you are available to receive it and if you are not available to receive, so we can stop our vehicle at our freight depot. If it dispatch without informing you, you are not home. So it's a totally waste of a carbon. Or it's totally waste of a diesel and petrol going to your place and coming back and not delivering the freight. Then we have to do that round twice. So it's gonna consume more petrol and gas and gonna produce more carbon emission. That's right. So how will you communicate it to the? We can communicate through the emails by phone call or by text. Like when you're leaving our depot, like in our company, we have automatic system. So whenever your freight is ready and going to deliver you, you'll see a text. So it's <laughs> uh, first, uh, firstly, uh, very well presented. Uh, the only thing missing was oh, just just the positives. Oh, uh, just positive. Uh, everything was in there. <laughs> uh, uh, the delivery was good. Then uh, the way y'all were like switching on and uh, we, the way y'all were moving, uh, it was really good. And just one. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Kick Kick them them back. Uh, okay. So uh, you've got a very f a good flow in your presentation and a good thought process. So nice, very nice. I liked it. Only the good point. Yeah, right? just one. Just yeah. one. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, it was every every everyone was understandable. So often, you know, sometimes in these classes that can be an issue. So that was that was good that everyone was clear in their speaking. Uh, each, uh, each group of members uh, is uh, present, uh, very confident, and uh, the sentence is uh, very clear and easy to follow. Thank you. Yeah, it was well paced and uh, overall. Uh, Every team member had involvement. It could be seen very clearly that every team member involved very nicely. Areas for improvement? Um, uh, I think that, uh, you know, uh, um, while you were flowing through uh, your presentation, uh, some of the information like, uh, you know, a little bit background about uh, your uh, company, uh, you know, could have been explained a little well uh, so that the exact problems could have, you know, been uh, marked out uh, then therefore you know uh, the way you have uh, you know uh, tried to compare it with the exemplary companies could have been you know much, much better you know uh, compared you know together um, as, uh, I think the recommendation and uh, and the uh, and evidence for the for the for the uh, for each, uh, for the each key point, uh, maybe, maybe improve is will be okay. Because uh, you, uh, because you just uh, say the, you just uh, ju just uh, use your words is not uh, from the reference. Yeah, maybe add the reference. Um, I would have liked a bit more defined layout, especially the introduction, um, to, to state what, what the purpose of um, the presentation was um, in more detail and, and how it was going to go, and then the sections, you know, more evident where, where each section was. Yeah. Uh, uh, you could have given more specific recommendations, like if you say monitor regularly, how would you do that? Because if you're telling a company you need to monitor regularly, that won't work. You'll have to tell them uh, what system you're putting in, uh, how do you monitor, and then uh, with the data, what would 
what can you do so the analysis too so yeah be more specific just two words won't do monitor regularly things like that uh, there can be non-verbal communication so while communicating you all can move here and there good eye contact and uh, rest everything was good thank you um, I suggest uh, in your presentations more more images uh, pictures of trucks and couriers. I mean, the, the new things that you are proposing uh, or drawing lessons from were the cycles and other low emission vehicles. So some pictures of those in your final report will, will add, add some uh, illustration to it. The, the second point is that um, I think Wendy had a nice little notebook there that she was referring to, that's, that's fine, that was really good, but someone had a really scruffy looking <laughs> notebook. <laughs> so uh, try, try and be more, more consistent or more discreet with the, the note aids that you, that you had. Uh, any other areas of, of improvement that anybody else is, wants to make? No other areas that were positive? I, I thought it was clearly well well rehearsed. You you were fluent speakers. It's obvious that you had worked through and rehearsed and rehearsed this presentation. You were here well before the start of class, getting everything ready to, to roll. So well organized and uh, well rehearsed, well structured. Uh, any other positive points? as long as you like now. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes, uh, y'all were just amazing. <laughs> <laughs> oh, going first is always a challenge, so you did well. Yeah. Really nice. <laughs> That's it. Yeah, I think we're done. Yeah. 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 Right, so again, congratulations for being up first. It's pretty scary on a challenging topic. Well, they get it. <laughs>